And just like that, the series is over. Celtics 113, Cavaliers 98. Celtics take the series four games to one. Don't know who was starting to sweat just a little bit when Cleveland stole one game, but it was never in doubt. Celtics just roll four games to one. After the first quarter, though, it was tied at 28. Boston outscored Cleveland in the second by six, only by one in the third, and by eight in the fourth. And that's enough to win it by 15, 113 98. The top performers in this game. We got Evan Mobley for the Cleveland Cavaliers at 33 points, 7 rebounds, 4 assists, 1 steal, and 2 blocks. On the other side, Jason Tatum. Wasn't talking a good talk last week in the press conference, but he did show up tonight. 25 points, 10 rebounds, 9 assists, 4 steals, and four block, or sorry, 0 blocks. Team stats, field goal percentage-wise, Cleveland not too bad at 48%. Celtics a little better, though, at 52%. Three-pointers, 13 for 31 for the Cavs, 19 for 43 for the Celtics, 44% to 41. Free throws, again, a little bit of an advantage to the Celtics. You add it up here, there, and everywhere, and you got the Celtics winning by as much as they did. 10 for 12 for free throws, 9 for 12 Cleveland, 75% to 83. Rebounds, of course the Celtics out-rebounded them 43-28. Offensive rebounds. Give it to the Celtics again, 11-6. Assists, give it to the Celtics again, 32-25. Steals, give it to the Celtics once again, 6-5. Blocks, you know what I'm going to say, 6-2 Celtics. And on and on and on. Points in the paint were pretty even, 42-44 Cleveland. Second chance points though, 12-5. And uh, the game stats, as far as the odds go, Celtics were minus 15.5. So hopefully you did not bite on the Celtics on the spread as you would have lost by half a point. And those are always, always sting the most when you lose just by that half point. I would rather lose by 20, 25 points than lose by that half damn point. But it is what it is. Over under was 205 and a half with the score being 113 to 98. The over does hit. So that's the game. That's the series. On to possibly the Boston Celtics against the New York Knicks. What say you, though? What do you think is going to happen? Are the Knicks going to finish off the Pacers? Are they going to be playing the Celtics? Let me know in the comment section below. If you're new to the channel, please do consider subscribing. I will be posting picks, plays, press conferences, and much, much more reactions, everything else on this channel. Trending Rabbit, you know what time it is. Take care, all, and we'll see you in the next video. This is... Trending Rabbit.